Hi guys, pray you're doing well this weekend. Uh, I've got a couple of things I want to show you that have come up. I just want to quickly remind you uh, guys of the Lady Gaga video that I covered quite a while ago now, a few months ago. Um, it was the, the Married the Night video. Um, basically, if I can remember now, it was depicting some sort of nuclear event, in my opinion, and also um, the birth of the Antichrist as well. Now, it had um, a lot of fire in it. It had. She was sporting a CND um, logo. Also, it had um, the Firebird and the Pontiac Firebird, if you guys remember. Also, uh, what else was in it? It was that strange mural in it as well that was in the. <coughs> like. Um, Catholic cathedral with a um, look like a subliminal baby being born with the cross and the anchor also with the writing underneath the cross is my anchor written backwards um, it also had the moon subliminal in it uh, which obviously was referenced to Isis um, at the beginning of the video she was being pushed into um, a sort of um, hospital ward and the x-rays in the background were showing a baby in a womb it's obvious it was obvious it was depicting the birth of a baby but you know the birth of an antichrist I would say I just want to show you a couple of pictures just to give you a reminder okay um, do you remember this one was from her one of the, the concerts she did now I think this is referring to if you compare this picture to the Trinity project which was the first ever nuclear test you'll see that this is pretty much identical and also here we have um, the colors where it seems it seems to be like an electron and a neutron okay which are the elements used for a nuclear um, bomb now um, Let's see. Um, here we have the the Pontiac Firebird, okay, the or the Phoenix, the Bird of Resurrection. Um, as, as I said, we had the Moon Subliminal in there as well. she was when she was being pushed into the hospital ward um, so basically it was, you know, it was depicting in my opinion um, the birth or the you know the rise of the Antichrist through um, a nuclear event okay which then will take us back to um, this picture that we looked at the other day which um, the Pope is sat in front of. You remember this, guys? It's um, they call it the Resurrection of Jesus. But um, the the actual video I uploaded, you'll see they talk about it's meant to depict Jesus rising from a nuclear crater, nuclear bomb crater. Okay. Now you know how they twist things with Mary and Jesus, but really it's it's Tammuz and Nimrod well this is obviously depicting the the rise of Apollyon the destroyer um, as it says from a nuclear bomb crater okay now this is what I want to show you today now this is um, Kylie Minogue's new video which was released um, I think it was, it's only been released for a couple of days anyway now at the start here if you just uh, take note that we've got like the spectrum of light like the rainbow okay now in this song you'll see reference to uh, Chinatown would be in it uh, the lyrics will go somewhere in the lines of move your body to my body before we disappear 
dance like it was the last dance of my life shaking breaking it's not the end of the world we're sitting on a time bomb okay now this video just happens to be filmed in London so I've got to say that um, you know it seems it's um, but it's been filmed in London and also it's called time bomb it does bring to mind a little bit Big Ben well which now I believe has been renamed to the Elizabeth Tower um, so as you can see uh, the start here she is if it's gonna play she's basically sporting a um, a heart, a red heart on her front here now I've got to say that it reminds me of um, Princess Diana was known as the the Queen of Hearts as well so let's just go on a little bit okay so again we have the we have the uh, she's wearing the CND logo again. Okay, the campaign for nuclear disarmament. Okay, I haven't looked. I haven't had a chance to look for all of this properly yet. I'm not sure how much stuff's in it, but this is just a basic rundown of it. Okay, so as you can see here, we've got the the whole London scene going on, the Union Jacks and all of that. Okay, so um, it's all a bit strange, you know, um, the whole setting and the, the the title of the song, Time Bomb. But then we're just going to have a quick look at this, which is where she performed this song, Time Bomb, on BBC. And as you can see, we've got the hearts again, but also, also we've got the peace. We've got the peace, the CND, and all that. As a lot of you guys will know, the the Antichrist will bring the false peace, um, the new world order. You know, bring order out of chaos. So the anti uh, the plans are for the Antichrist to bring the peace out of the chaos and try and bring people to worship the beast as well as explained in revelations okay so then again you know the whole peace thing um this is a just a screenshot of the madonna super bowl ritual where we had again the world peace so there you know obviously doing the, the predictive um mind programming subliminal stuff here with the whole peace thing um but then again we also have this again we have the the rainbow the spectrum um in the center here we have the little um blonde haired boy wearing the traditional bavarian outfit uh destroying the weapons so he's bringing peace and as you can see here We've got the banner, we've got peace on the banner, everyone gathering to worship the beast. Okay. Right. So we're going to move on to the next song. Now, this is called um, Florence and the Machine. The, the, the song is called Spectrum. Okay, we'll just have a quick look at this. Okay, so spectrum, plural spectral spectrums, a condition that is not limited to a specific set of values, but can vary infinitely with a continuum. The word saw its first scientific use within the field of optics to describe the rainbow of colours in visible light when separated using a prism, so on and so forth. Okay, so basically you know, we've got the rainbow again, okay? Now a lot of the uh, Olympic adverts and posters they've all been either these spectrums of light but mainly 
they've been you know showing the the whole rainbow thing okay which I think is a big a big part and it's, it's become you know I've noticed it's been showing up quite quite often it's like in that cartoon advert they've done they have the rainbow as well Okay, so yeah, right. So this Florence and the Machine um, video it starts basically. She's got she's got a light coming from her legs, okay, in between her legs, which I think is representing again the birth of the Antichrist, okay. Um, also, we've got the clam here. The clam is a symbolic and represents Venus. Again, you know, Isis, Ishtar, all the same person. So again, with the Gaga video, we've got the moon subliminal. Um, so it's just, you know, it's, it's repeating itself. Let's just see if we can go on a little bit here. Okay, I'll just quickly mention that um, in this video, I'm going to put the links down for you guys. I'm not going to play the music and stuff because I probably I won't be able to upload it. But the lyrics are basically down the lines of "Say my name, and everybody will illuminate. We will never be afraid again." So basically, say my name, and everybody will illuminate. So it's basically, I think that's basically depicting again bring you know, the the beast seeking worship and also we will never be afraid again you know that's the, down the whole peace side of things again so let's see if we can go up to here Okay, so can we see, can you see this picture here now, right? Again, we've got her. It looks like she's almost coming out of this explosion that's coming, that's permanently in the background of this video. Okay, so she's rising up out of this explosion. We've got the sun rays illuminating in the background. We've got the pyramid here. Also, we've got the clock, which looks like the, the face of Big Ben going on as well. Um, we've got the pretty much universal Egyptian theme going on. Okay. Okay, so here she is, again in the in the explosion. We've got the clock tower. It looks very similar as well to the the Venus. Um, a lot of the Venus symbology you see where she's standing on the clam or um, that other video I uploaded the the one where it was, uh, the lady was dressed as um, Lucifer and all the bodies were at the bottom of her okay so here again we have the moon subliminal, Isis. Okay. So I'm going to put these links down for you guys and um, you can check it out for yourself. God bless you.